Well, yeah, the tone of the, the film is very interesting because, you know, like you mentioned, you've got uh, a comedy element to it, and, and then you've got the horror added to it, and then you add this um, heart, which uh, is, is my personally my favorite part of the film. Um, the movie's got heart, and uh, I think that's what, what most of our audience is going to be surprised by, is how much they actually care about these characters. My character's Ben, and and he's a bit shy, um, and he doesn't have, or he doesn't, he doesn't, he's not aware that he has the confidence to, you know, to take hold of a situation and uh, take charge. Um, and this is, you know, he realizes that through the course of the movie, and he ends up like, you know, saving the day. And um, it's a, it's a total arc for Ben. Um, and uh, he's, well, he's a scout. And uh, he's kind of got, like Chris uh, explains, it's one foot in adulthood and, and one foot in childhood. So uh, he still loves, he, he does love being a scout, but he's, he's ready to, to move on to bigger and better things, like, you know, going to parties and dating girls. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of action. There's some comedy, and um, there's a zombie apocalypse. Um, and, and, and the film just distributes a, a great balance of that. I feel that audience members are going to be able to take away so much. I feel like they're, you know, they're going to get to see uh, some great action, some funny comedy, um, some killer-looking zombies. I feel like they're going to, um, and I think they're going to be just blown away by how much they actually care about the characters in the film and, and the story itself. Hello, Valerie here with a cool movie fact. Josh Hutcherson read the entire Hunger Games trilogy in five days to prepare for his role as Peter. For this and more movie facts, click on more videos. See you!